What is the current ratio? The current ratio is a liquidity ratio that measures a company's ability to pay short-term liabilities as they come due. Basically, it answers the question, can the company use their current assets to pay down their current debts? How is the current ratio measured? By comparing the company's current assets to their current liabilities. Let's use Orange Inc. to demonstrate this ratio. The current assets of Orange Inc. include cash, accounts receivable, inventory, and prepaid expenses. All short-term assets that are either cash will be turned into cash or will be used or consumed within the upcoming year. Let's just page down for a moment. Orange's current liabilities includes accounts payable and accrued liabilities, wages payable, income taxes payable, current portion of long-term debt, and unearned revenue. These are the liabilities that will either be paid or settled in the upcoming year. How is the current ratio calculated? The current ratio is equal to current assets divided by current liabilities. The current ratio is called current because, unlike other liquidity ratios, it incorporates all the current assets and all the current liabilities. The current ratio is also called the working capital ratio. We're going to use Orange Inc. to demonstrate the current ratio. Note that I have provided a link to my worksheets in the description below the video. I suggest you pause the video now and download them so you can follow along. We're going to calculate the current ratio for 2022, where the current assets are 225,000, 2021, current assets 180,000, and 2020, where the current assets are 172,000. We also need the current liabilities. Total current liabilities are 142,000, 119,000, and 89,000 from 2022 down to 2020. Let's do the calculations. Remember, we're going to take the current assets for each year and divide it by the current liabilities based on the statement of financial position from Orange Inc. In 2022, the current ratio is $1.58. In 2021, the current ratio is $1.51. In 2020, the current ratio is $1.93. How can we interpret the current ratio? And we're going to cover that in the next video.